So in the last few videos, we've talked about some of the accessories offered in the line of Fordham by Oro. And these are going to be working great in your flex shaft, your micro motors, or any of your other hand pieces similar to that. Now today I'm going to introduce you to a couple of the options that can be used with your tapered spindles on your polishing arbor or the bench lathe. Now these are meant to be an inside ring or an inside bracelet buff, however you can use them in some additional ways also. Let's take a look now. So here you can see I have the Fordham bench lathe as well as my filter hood. I like this filter hood because it has a light and it's also fully contained with the filters in it. I don't have to have an additional vacuum system for this. Now currently here on the left I have a tapered spindle that's holding on one of my cotton buffs. On the right hand side I have an adjustable collet adapter that allows me to put other options into there. For today we're going to focus here on the tapered spindle and we're going to talk a little bit about these felt ring buffs as well as the bracelet buff. In the previous videos you've seen we've done a lot of polishing of our rings with the different accessories on our micro motors. Well in this case today I want to do the inside of my rings with the felt buff. Now there are two sizes for the inside ring buff and you can see that there's one that's a little taller and a little larger as well as the one that's smaller. The larger one is going to come in a pack of two whereas the small comes in a pack of six. We also have an inside felt bracelet buff so that's going to be great if we're working on some larger pieces. To use this I'm going to just take this and I'm going to screw this onto the, sp the spindle until it's nice and tight. I also want to make certain that it is true. So what I can do here is turn on my bench lathe. See this wobble here? We don't want that. So we'll just take a second and make some adjustments. until you have it ni running nice and smooth. Now you'll notice here also that this sticks out a little bit. So what I can do, I can just move this hood out just slightly. Now when you're using these, you want to keep these at a, no higher than 7,000 RPM, which is ideal for our Fordham bench lathe because this runs at a max speed of 7,000 RPM. As always, whenever you're working with a bench lathe or any of your Fordham hand pieces that are going to be spinning, if you have long hair, you want to make certain you take the time, pull that back and secure it, wear your safety glasses as well as a mask. But even with a filter hood, you don't want any of those particles to come back. Now that we have everything ready to go, next thing we're going to do is load this up with our compound. In this case, I'm going to use platinum white. Where this comes with six different options, I may have a different compound for each one of them, and I would mark here on the handle what I'm using for that particular buff. So first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to turn on my filter. I'm going to turn on the machine. I'm using platinum white and I'm just going to run that along my buff and I'm ready to go. One of the things I like to do if I'm doing an inside ring, now I can come in here and hold the ring myself or I can use a ring holder that will allow me to bring this in a little bit more safely. Now in this case my ring is just a little bit too small for that. So I'll do one side, bring it on, and do the other. As this buff gets used, it will compress a little bit, but now I have a beautiful inside polish on my ring. Or I can also select to do this by hand. The thing that you need to make certain is that you've got a good secure hold on your piece. And now we have a great inside polish on our rings. To remove this, you'll just hold on to your spindle and you can unscrew. Now we'll use that same process for our felt buff for the inside bracelet. 
Once again, I want to make certain that I get this on as square as possible. To test it, just turn on your machine. There should not be any wobble here. So once again, I'm going to turn on my filter. Turn on my machine. Load up my buff. And I'm ready to go. This can also be used as an outside felt buff. Now these buffs can be used for any compound that you have. So in metals or jewelry, I'm going to be using things like red rouge, maybe some white diamond or Tripoli, anything like that. Plus, if I'm doing any kind of woodwork, I could also use it with some carnauba wax. So as you can see, by just adding a few different accessories, you can make your life a lot easier when it comes to polishing either the inside of a bracelet or the inside of a ring. And as you saw, I can also use that to polish the outside. So join me next time as we continue our polishing series as we look at more accessories, both for the bench lathe as well as the micromotor or flex shafts. We'll see you guys next time. <music>